Welcome back to Hearts of Iron 4, the road to 56 as United Scandinavia. So where I, le where I left off w last time was prepping for the inevitable attack push into Germany. Or yeah, German held territory at least. On the intelligence front we've got, got some fake units coming that will stage a naval invasion of Königsberg. Throw a few extra troops away. We're prepping for, for a push in here. Start developing the more modern tanks and are starting to upgrade them. Started um, rebuilding our submarine fleets and everything. Because we basically got wiped out. But then I think we managed to at least hold them back. That's the thing I've noticed about playing it, about this playthrough so far. We can actually hold pretty well. Sure, the Italians keep try sending single divisions to um, land here, here, or wherever, just to wind me up, I think. They're trolling me. You know how we deal with trolls? We burn them. Maybe not. Anyway. So the V2 Infantry Division, I'm probably going to replace this support anti-tank with either signal companies for the extra breakthrough or possibly logistics companies to help with supply. Especially since I need to get flamethrowers as well to buff up the engineers. The field anti-vehicle kit means that, sh that Road to 56 adds. All our infantry and motorized infantry will double their piercing and they'll do extra heart attack on rifle probably anti tank rocket next at the moment I'm basically just prepping for for the uh, the final push no push <laughs> probably won't be swear yeah the the French are not coming back from that unless National Spain joins the war but in that case we've got worse things to worry about because I have nothing else to really do, I'm going to try... This is one thing I usually do when I'm playing as Ireland, just build up railways everywhere. Like, I know there's no real need for it now, but a lot of the times what I've done is actually build them here to try and help supplies skirt um, roles around the Mediterranean. But since we pretty much control that area now, it doesn't really make me... I'm just doing it because... Because I want to. It's just a force of habit. Now there's a surprise. The Soviets have declared war on Iran. Mainly so they can get a puppet with these war motor reports here. We might actually be at war with them as well. Or is that a uh, game I'm thinking of? Means the Brits will probably get involved as well. The way of, not much in the way of supplier here in Balochistan. And again, we've lost air superiority over the. See, I'm starting to think that I might need to just build up a few more factories. And I'm actually just going to build some of these Saab airplanes because we need more of that. We need. We need air superiority, and close air support doesn't really do that very well. As well as I'd like. And finally, a freight convoys are coming through the North Sea and the Norwegian coast. Oh, Jeremy, curse your sudden but inevitable trail of your pup. We're technically in the same faction, so but you know what I mean. Well, I mean that the principality of Mong Nago has broken their neutrality. Benito Mussolini has launched a small invasion of the tiny city state of Monaco. The occupation seems to be lenient, as the government has been allowed to remain in power and their citizens' wealth has not been seized. 
So basically, more like na 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 na. We take money go thing. Oh well, and they're pushing into Vichy France. Good. Let them both fight. Oh, did the Dutch overthrow them? You know, I think it might be might be go time. Here we go. So now I think I'm going to go back up, up to service by requirements. This is this going to slow down our industry and our construction and output? But I think it's I think we have to do it. Yeah, they do not have supply here. I want to make sure I don't don't run out of it either. And free repair, we get a lot of that. These guys push down towards Hanover. Huh. I think we're actually going to do this. So it looks like some British and American troops have landed in the Netherlands. I think we can't link up with them. Not much we can really do about that except keep pushing. Du, 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 du. Keep pushing, boys. At the moment we're kind of bottled, bottled up around Kiel, but I think we might, we might actually manage that eventually. A little bit of micromanagement here. I don't really like people doing this to me in real life, but sometimes you do have to. There, I think we got Kiel, so that's going to help. Okay, the 25th Army Division, part in the Siege of Hamburg. Division attack, I think. Fuck. We lost one of our... of our heavy cruisers. How much we can really do about that now? Okay, vent. Get yourself over to Berlin and keep that network going. You need to keep pushing. That looks like it's not going to be too much of a push there. I 
many tied up here as I'd as I'd have liked. A few around here. That's going. It's like we're making making progress at least. Please. It's taking I probably should have mobilized them a little sooner. It's taking a while for them to get there. This, no, I'm not going to bother with this Turkish state building. Ooh, our submarines are getting hit. Not much I can really do about that at the moment. Seems to be a bit of a supply problem getting through here. Yeah, they don't have supplies. Why just lend lease them some trucks? supplies at least okay we're starting pushing us i think we are managing to push back right i'm going to try tightening up this line a bit sweden i want you to focus Sweden command focus on the eastern side denmark focus west Oh wait, that's the oh, damn it, I did the wrong thing, didn't I? And hold the attack until you've actually got until you've all caught up. Well, that's our land doctrines fully fleshed out. Bombers. Might be time to start putting them on tactics. Strategic bombing at night. So, companies, where are they? Like I said, I'm going to replace the support anti tank with. Uh, we do lose some piercing. And some defense and a lot of defense actually. Yeah, a lot of hard attack and piercing that we lose, but we you use less supplies. I think that's worth it. Also, I haven't received researched this yet, but that's coming soon. Now we lost one of our ace pilots. Fortunately, we have another one. I have no idea what that means, Bush. The, could go with this, could go with air. 
None of these are really useful to me at the moment. Let's go with this because they gain less intel on us. I think it's time we start pushing again. <laughs> Did he just sound like he was saying bullshit, bullshit, bullshit? <laughs> right, uh, push towards Berlin. I'm not entirely, hmm. probably do it a few more troops in there. Nice. I'm just going to deploy all of these now. Now they're under. This time we buffed our artillery. Well, there's actually some marshes around uh, Wilhelmshaven. And what do you know? These, um,. A Jaeger to fit infantry battalion with these guys is going to help a little bit. Not enough to really make too much of a difference, but right, I'm gonna sign one of these away from the away from C into I know we're losing air superiority there now, but that's not such a big a problem right now. My problem. Is going to be that we need to keep pushing. So sabotage the so hit their hit them in combat, hit their trucks, hit their trains. Anywhere that we can, we that we can screw them over. Pushing. Yeah, we're losing some support from combat casualties, but well, what do you know? We've actually caused twenty three thousand casualties. Considering that we were literally just sitting around doing nothing for a while. That's well. It's actually not all that much. More to the point though, we're taking some of their victory points. And we're at the we're right at the doorstep of Berlin. Yeah, this might actually work out. Now let's see. Oh, the power. And it exhorts some heroes. Oh, as I'll well crank out some of these. Hey, we're getting a lot of um by territory. Hmm. Let's see. Let's target. I might change change Germany to the hmm, secret police. See how they like being on the end of a Gestapo. Oh, what are we short of? We can. I think we were both. Now we're okay for trucks. Oh, it's rubber we're now short. I'm going to try and correct that immediately.
It's gonna take us a while to get all these vices up. I probably should have done them sooner. But no matter. Stands, it looks like we're this is gonna take a while, but I think we can get there. Might as well try and uh, micromanage a few more of them. Basically, if we can get rid of this little pocket here, that's that's pretty much one less thing we need to worry about. I think we might have. Yep. Yes, we are getting a lot of things. We need a lot more close air support. We're losing a fair chunk of Oh wait, those are the close air support. Those are the fighters. Derp. Yes, I'm an Aegis. Deal with it. I have no idea what that means. Translations are welcome. Oh, what do I get here? Infantry experts, because we have a lot of infantry, or logistics wizards. I think infantry experts. That's just too good to pass up. Now I could go with some probing attack. Paratroopers, that's not much use. I just save this for once we get infantry leader because then we can get infantry experts. Well, that's another German tank division or motorized infantry division wiped out. Quite a lot of red bubbles where we're losing, but a lot of them seem to be put be pushed to. Oh. Most of these are disadvantages because we're not in fully in position. Up a bit, let free regroup. At the moment, I have no real way to get our war support up a little bit extra. It's a bit of a pain, but there's not much I can really do about that. Support. I think about it. Might as well get this because it'll it'll um lower the amount of garrisons we need in Germany a bit. You can see there's a lot. There's a lot of resistance there. Nice. Some. Still not in position. The fact that we have air superiority helps. Ooh, inferior enemy, I like to see that. Ah, uh, not this again. I'm going to move this reaction force down here to provide a fallback line. probably gonna be enough subs for now like we have me do we have yes bump this up anymore oh yeah yes I think I will I probably need to start looking at some um, 
new destroyer classes. Okay, start pushing, boys. Well, this is going to take a while. France Scandinavian Railway. Level 1 railway from North Norwich to North Slays this week. Probably don't have one all the way up here. I don't really have much to actually spend this on. Do here. Go with. <laughs> Bicycle infantry. Run by Bicycle Repairman. Should have done this ages ago. Guessing that means hold positions. Well, that's not what I wanted to see. All right, this reaction force is going to go here, and they are just going to wipe this. Oh no, you idiots! That was the wrong thing. Wipe that German. And division out. Get rid of it. Some. Another factory out of this. Keep them out of their uh, things. I have them up here. I'm going to move them back up here. Let's see, what do I. Are really short of they're really short of rubber is what I was going to say. That's injuring our supplies. Go to get truck flies through. Basically whole position. Looks like this area is roughly stable. At very least we're probably drawing some people away from them. Now ticking up a little bit. Like we've lost a lot of people to the Germans. They've lost more. Unfortunately, we have a massive stockpile of trucks built up, but this rubber I might just start scaling some of these trains back and put them in the small arms. That's the steel is the one thing we are not at medium. We're not short of those. I'm gonna put these guys, have them push in towards the, towards the Benelux. I know they're not as well equipped as some of our other guys, but they're all good enough divisions.
You move to Jutland's bridge. Yeah, we might need a lot more divisions now I think about it. We don't have air superiority either, which is a bit of a pain. I mean, for this. And we need way more oil. America. Sell us some extra oil. So I'm going to leave it here for this episode. We've started pushing, but I'm not sure we can actually push further. The base is stalled just outside Berlin. Hmm. I think in the next episode I might try something a little different. Not sure what yet. But I'm going to leave it there for now. See you in the next one.